Hi, my name is Hannah Northcott. I'm the director of Annie here at MKIS. The sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow there'll be some. So last year, Last year, James Instone, the music director, Aline Young, the choreographer, and I came together to brainstorm what musical we would like to do for this year. When we looked at our demographics or kids that we think would audition for a musical, we realized that a lot of the students that we had were girls. And what musical had a lot of girls? Annie. As Miss Hannigan sang, she was dripping with little girls. So Annie was a popular choice. And then, on a personal level, since it was going to be my swan song or my last directorial project here at NKIS, I wanted to do Annie because Annie was the first musical I saw when I was five years old. And I, and I wanted to come full circle artistically by making that my gift to this community before I left. So what happened was we had to plan Annie in the first semester and then I went on a couple of month maternity leave and then I came back and we had to go on full rehearsal so what I did in the beginning was I met with my awesome super duper creative team so I met with James to talk about the music and plan out the rehearsal schedule for that Adeline we identified all the dance numbers that we had to do and which kids would have to do it I talked to Naz and Robin because we had to brainstorm costumes we had we wanted an authentic 1930s feel so that they could start sewing costumes then I spoke to Faye and Lynn and Daryl about the set. And little did I know that Annie had multiple set changes from or the orphanage to Hannigan's office to the mansion scene. So we had to really get creative on how we can use the, the entire stage to, to create the different scenes in Annie. And it was a lot of fun. And all the committees went into the production process. And then when I came back in January, we hit rehearsal intense intensive rehearsals, kids already knew their music, kids already knew their dances, so all I had to do was come here and block everything and put everything together. So it was a very, as any musical, it was a tiring and long process, but I'm really happy with the product. MKIS Theatre has become a community theatre where there's so many people involved. I have a, a core group of dedicated parent volunteers who has been working with me for the past four years in making the costumes, building and creating the sets. And more than just people who work together, we've become really close friends. And when you create something together, there's a bond that weaves your life together and I know that wherever I may be and wherever they will be, we will have this bond of being a part of the theater community here at MKIS. I'm also going to miss, of course, my students. I work them hard. <laughs> I work the students really hard. The rehearsal process is really long and I have high expectation and high, high standards from the kids. I want to train them the way that, the same way, almost the same way that professional theater expect from their actors. So in, in that process, in that rehearsal process of each of us giving what we can give in the best way we could, I was able to see students go beyond their comfort zones and really soar and really fly and find their light. I'm going to miss, of course, uh, my colleagues, you know, James, music director, Alan, dance teacher, Gerald, Wade, John, and all the people that I work here. So MPIS, Thank you so much for the wonderful four years and the eight shows that we have shared together. I'm going to miss you all. And congratulations to the cast and crew of Annie. We pulled out an awesome show and I'm so proud of you all. The sun will come out.